Natalie with Vitiligo Friends and thanks so much for your patience while I've been gone for a few days. My son went to a marine boot camp this week and uh, so we've been having a lot of changes around our house and um, so it's been a bit difficult this week for me so I thought I would uh, just take a little bit of time to make the adjustments before I start coming back and um, doing my podcasts. Um, let's see, while I was having this quiet time, I decided to go on and do the um, experiment for ginkgo biloba. There's already been a successful trial done. It was um, up in Canada. I did a podcast with the, one of the um, doctors who was involved in it, Dr. Suzerko. I will leave a link uh, to the podcast uh, to that on um, under the show notes if you'd like to go back and listen to him talk about it It's very very interesting and, and such a caring doctor too. That's the one thing I took away from that uh, aside from the fact that he had done a successful trial um, That he was uh, just someone that really cared about people with vitiligo and, and I really liked that a lot so ginkgo biloba that's what I'm going to be doing and um the great news is, is it's not a, a blind trial. You know, I know that it has had success. So we're going to try it ourselves. Uh, some of the stipulations, I'm going to go ahead and read a little bit about what they have um, on the uh, website under Biomed Central, which is um, where they put their their notes for their clinical trial. And I'll leave a link for this too if, you, if you're interested in reading about it. It's... it's um, pretty comprehensive, so I'm not going to go into the whole thing, but I wanted to um, read a little bit uh, about what they did, because I'm going to try to follow it as closely as possible. Um, theirs was for 12 weeks, so we're going to do 12 weeks, and um, what they did is they had everyone take um, one pill twice a day, so once before breakfast, and once before dinner, um, an hour before you ate, uh, so that it would not disturb your stomach. And I'm looking for the specifics here on the particular kind. Here it is, okay. So, um, Ginkgo Biloba, and the brand that they used was uh, called Soroyal Health Canada Natural Product. Um, I didn't find that here. However, um, the ingredients in it um, I was able to find so that was good so what I got was I just went to Whole Foods and I got this and um, it's there's 240 in here so if I'm doing this for uh, 12 weeks and taking two a day this is more than enough that'll be plenty and uh, let's see so here were the specifics and I'll write this in the show notes too so you don't have to remember this or anything but I wanted to go over it on here with you it's uh, 60 milligrams of ginkgo biloba, and the type is this. It's standardized to 15 milligrams of ginkgo flavonoid glycosids and 4 milligrams of terpene lactones per pill. I didn't even practice that. Can you believe? Those are really, um, those are difficult words to pronounce. <laughs> if I didn't get them right, no big deal, because you will see how to spell it, and, and frankly, Every brand, there was a four different brands um, at Whole Foods, and each one of them did contain these uh, two particulars. So um, that really shouldn't be an issue. Uh, it's pretty standard, I would imagine. And again, it said take one oral capsule twice per day, oh, 10 minutes before breakfast and dinner for the duration of the trial. So 10 minutes before you eat. Um, no other treatments for vitiligo were permitted, so... I'm guessing that any kind of topical ointment, um, I don't think there's anything that one can ingest uh, for it, uh, so probably no topical, and I don't do that anyway, so I'm not going to worry about that, but all of the medications and medical treatments were allowed and monitored, so I am going to keep taking my other vitamins. Um, you know, I really decided to do this for two reasons, one, well, three reasons, one, a lot of people ask me about it. And I've been planning on doing it. Um, two, I know it works. And three, the vitamin D is taking way too long. So if I know that this is going to take about 12 weeks um, to start showing 
some reactions, hopefully with my skin, then, then um, you know, that's a whole lot better than just me taking something and, and wondering if it's ever going to work. I'm just not patient like that. I really want to find something that, that repigments my skin. And I know you do too. I'm going to put a link to this uh, trial information so that you can read all the particulars because it's very interesting and I'm not going to go over all that here. But I will say that I haven't had dinner yet today so I'm going to start taking them now. So I'm going to take one now and um, I'm going to still do my questions, question and answer every day and then I'll give you an update um, ever so often about this because again it's going to be a 12 week long process but um, I'm going to give you updates as to whether or not I see anything and how exciting it'll be when I do see something and as soon as I do see a difference I will begin um, posting pictures so that you can see the the progression of any kind of repigmentation so um, I look forward to talking with you tomorrow with another question and answer session Please don't hesitate uh, to send your questions in. I love all the ones I've been getting and I'm going to get to each one of them. If I don't answer it here on a podcast, I do answer every one of them um, via email or if you put a comment question on the Facebook page, I get to all of them um, each day. So uh, if you don't hear it here, know that at least you will be answered for sure. Have a wonderful rest of the day and I will talk with you tomorrow. Bye.